Hello guys, hello boys and girls, I'm Luigi and today I will do a new review, a new um, fragrance opinions and sharing about uh, another fragrance, uh, not so new, not so old, okay, from uh, some years ago and um, from this brand I have some fragrances uh, already I think I have only one more and uh, no two more yes and uh, the old the, the first one the oldest one is very nice I love it it's a very good powerful masculine scent and then they have done many flankers um, in the years to come from the 80s until uh, 2000 okay I think they stop it uh, doing uh, fragrances uh, since uh, the new decade uh, around 2010 and uh, this one I will uh, present you today is uh, maybe one of the latest done uh, in fact it's from 2007 um, it's a uh, different kind of fragrance is uh, it shares nothing uh, of the original one if not the name and this fragrance is this one there are not so many uh, strangely many reviews on the on YouTube there are reviews for everything today but not so much for this fragrance and this is Bichon man nude and uh, this is the fancy box, a bit uh, rainbow colored, golden but with uh, these uh, rainbow shades. And uh, this is uh, the bottle, uh, the usual bottle for uh, the, uh, the usual uh, Bichon fragrances uh, that uh, remind me a uh, pacifier for the babies, and uh, somehow also. Um, a turban this one this piece the the, the, the cap okay and uh, I always like it this kind of uh, presentation because it's something di very different is 75 ml usually there is other there isn't other mm, uh, shapes and um, uh, 30 ml 50 ml only 75 and this one is um, a musky scent, a white musk scent. Okay, so uh, uh, the original Bijan Man is a uh, very powerful scent, it's very strong, it's very 80 scent. Okay, it has multifaceted, it, is, it has so much ingredients inside. The same is for Bijan Women that uh, it is a fantastic scent the both couple of scents of this time of the late 80s was really really a fine uh, uh, creation but uh, they have done many um, many others many other fragrances maybe the only one that are really have gotten some importance and uh, quality was the DNA kind of fragrances always by Bijan Don somehow in the 90s but it, it, uh, it didn't took too much um, um, importance okay uh, uh, commercial it was a commercial failure in some ways it was a good fragrance I have only a mini form the DNA from men was a good fragrance, but somehow, somehow it wasn't successful. And then uh, they've done other fragrances from Bijan Men, Bijan Woman, Wicked, Black, uh, Sport, I, th I think. Then uh, they've done the Mute one and the Beep one. It uh, was the last one, the last fragrance I, I think they've done. They tried to do. do and now I don't know if they produ pr produce fragrances anymore. 
uh, I only know that it's easy to find still the classic Bijan men and women, but the rest of the series is all gone. In fact, this one uh, I had some trouble to find uh, until uh, it was easy to find some years ago, to say three, four years ago, but now it was uh, really hard here in Europe. Maybe in the United States it's a bit easier because the market of this um, country, uh, okay, this brand is Ameri an American brand, so the market is uh, an house market, okay. So it's not an importation like uh, for us. And this white mask scent is really fantastic. I don't like too much white mask because I find it sometimes too simple to uh, trans us uh, too much of uh, uh, laundry uh, detergent uh, so we can it's a, it's a pleasant scent but sometimes it's too plain to um, it, it is not easy to use sometimes uh, a laundry detergent, detergent scent as a perfume you know uh, it's, it's, it's a bit complicated because okay it makes us uh, feel uh, uh, very very uh, it is a good smell very pleasant sometimes but, uh, and it's clean but no not everybody want to smell it's too clean okay and this scent as as ingredients mask gardenia citruses woods and amber so it is very easy in its um, its uh, uh, ingredients uh, in its uh, uh, composition but I must say this one maybe it's the best white scent I've ever smelled for men to say for men because it's really unisex and uh, it is long lasting it, it it has not so much phases only the initial uh, first five ten minutes has a very strong uh, pungent smell of citruses maybe a bit synthetic but after this time it becomes a very lovely mask very lovely mask plus soapiness okay i can find it in in, in this one and I must say I've got so much compliments I don't want to be the kind of person that says ask for compliments and want to wear something for compliments but this one has made me have so much compliments for a simple white uh, mask scent okay so it means that also nowadays it works still works good okay what I must say, uh, fine fragrance, easy to wear. There is no too much important uh, cases uh, or uh, situation to wear this one. Uh, it is really an easy scent, so you can pull it off uh, in any way, in any uh, condition. Okay, and uh, you will smell it. People will smell it. Only three, four, maybe five uh, uh, sprays. They will notice you and they will give you compliments. What can I say? If you find it, I and if you like white mask, I say go and try it. It is sometimes not too uh, expensive. Okay, I find it for 20, 25 euros, but before it wasn't only 10 euros before it was only 10 years it was so cheap and uh, i've regretted the time uh, i could i could it f find it easily because i could uh, pay for less and have a great scent already some years ago but if you can find it easily go for it it will be an easy compliment puller scent if you want one and that's all. Bijaman nude, great scent, easy to wear.
it's very simple. So, so be uh, next time. Bye bye.